uh, greats before the game. Uh, our viewers tonight are going to see another great here at Deron Holmes. Inside out. Now give it go. Holmes in traffic. Gets it off the glass. Of the Down to 10 seconds to go and got a wide open look. LaSalle with the rebound. Still 2-0 Dayton. Zan with the mid-range jumper evens it up. You know, both, both possessions, Kale, LaSalle's showing how they're going to play the, the pick and the swing the dice. You want to pick your poison, but they third in the nation. Santos. And they get, it says six on the shot clock. He hesitates, drives and kicks to Brantley. Brantley gets room, takes the three, pow! A welcome sign for Brantley because he's not been shooting the ball great from the three-point line. Brickis, a fadeaway baseline jumper, and the difficult it is shooting in this cold goal arena in January. They fire one in. Valver Fisasi. Bradley finds Valver Fisasi in the corner for three, and he knocks it down. Of doing that, if something goes wrong on one end of the floor, he almost immediately makes up for it on the other end. Brea pulls up for his fourth point of the game and extends the lead. Keeps the dribble, tries to find his way in, in a little bit of trouble, has a baseline cutter and a nice soft finish by Wujiji. Santos, Bennett, Holmes fakes the three, drives in traffic, pulls up and hits that soft runner. He's so good at getting to the pain in traffic and the pain at the rim. Nine points, Marrero has some room, pow! Big miss there. Elvis a drive and a kick. Bennett looking to drive, layup good. You get a breast, uh, rest as well as, you know, two with Gill here. Gill drives, spins, drives, lays it in off the glass. Of the bucket, cuts the lead to three. I got totally screened out by that, but on the post, Shepard providing resistance. Forces him into a near turnover, gets it. Now spins on the baseline. Ten of the shot clock. Holmes trying to oppose his will and eventually does get the foul. And Holmes goes back to the free throw line, already 13 points. Two for two from the stripe. Let's call for three for three. Cold. Now in transition. Great defense by Brickis, but it goes right back into the hand. In the game is how he got to the paint and kicked for open shots. Marrero gets two defenders in the air, pulls up, takes the mid-range jumper, and is rewarded. Wow. And when you're cold. Coming off the screen is Santos, but Elvis fakes the three. Now posts it inside. Holmes unselfish. Elvis, he'll cash in. And we just talked about. Oh, Elvis. Just waited for the lane to half. Elvis. They're gonna have to defend the three. Holmes and Yochus. Holmes. Yochus stands tall. Fade away. Wow. <laughs> now they go to the top trying to reward the big guy, and he gets the lay-in. So, but Yochus didn't foul. And forced him into a low percentage shot. And here's a runner that will not go, but Yochus doesn't get the rebound, and then it's right back up. They get it to Marrero. Caps and shoot three at the buzzer. Oh, off the heel. Good luck for Marrero, but he... Bennett now. Three-pointer won't go. Brantley with a hesitation. Left-handed dribble into the paint. He goes, gets separation, pulls up, and that jumper won't stick. So Brantley now two for nine from the field. Holmes wide open for three. Santos misses. And that time, Shepard doesn't. By Zan. Shepard. Looking to attack with three on the shot clock. Mid-range jumper, got it off the bounce. Can't afford that many empty trips. Holmes looking to drive on Volver Fasasi. Wow. Corner, Shepard. Now Brickus gets it back. Pump fakes, gets his defender to fly by. Shepard for three. Pow! 16 minute media timeout of the second half. 40 to 28, the Dayton advantage. Come back out. Eight on the shot clock, Brickus drives. Now Shepard's gonna drive in traffic. That's swatted away by Holm. Doing a good job against the Dayton Bigs. Off the screen, pull up jumper that will not go. Another double tap allows Dayton to get. Zan, that ball was just beyond, too far of a reach for Zan to get the shot up. Now Brickus will take the three, that will not go. But there's Tunde Valver Fasasi, who gets it back from Brickus. Shepard. Hesitates, steps back, that fakes the three, puts it on the deck. Valberg for Sassi for three. Pow! Big force with offense rebound number nine, and only five second chance points to show for them. Santos 
Wow, a blocking foul called on Tunda Valberg Fasasi. Hey, he contact. So now, instead of it being a seven or six point game, it's back up to 11 and now 12. A skip past the Brickus, takes the three, puts it on the deck. Brickus looks, you know, pump fakes, looking for contact. Does he get the call, but he does. Points against uh, Dayton. Didn't score very much. Five on the shot clock. Elvis dribbles at the top, avoids Brantley. And at the buzzer, that's a killer. Neat resume, uh, he'll be missed. So the Explorers had cut this to a single digit game. Herrera will try to do it again, and pow! He does. So it's a 10 point lead. My math has never been my strength. Here's Yochus for the lay in, and now it is an eight point game. Herrera had everybody frozen with the deep threat. Well, team. Fires it up to Yochus. Yochus finds Brantley. Brantley in the corner. Gill's first action of the second half. He's going to drive. Lay it in and one. He's back, baby. You'll see here. Swings the ball. Gill takes two hard dribbles. And then when he hits the floor, gets up and smiles. Trying to get points out of it. Eight to go. Six on the shot clock. Brickus pulls up. Baseline jumper good. Jameer Brickus is the single digits. They only gave him two on that meet. So it wasn't my math after all. Look for the pip, pick and roll here. A uh, big three. Pal shot, one of the best. Inbounds to Brickus for three. Pow! Again, you got Holmes, home. Holmes in, inside, surrounded by three shooters. Bennett does it again. Wow. Holmes fakes the three, looks to drive on Yochus, misses, loses the handle briefly. Now forces the big man in, drop step, layup good to Ron Holmes. And we'll see. Drop step by Holmes, just has its way with discarded by Gill. Gill forces him wide, hits the break in traffic, and no good. Rebound Shepard. Get the ball in the killer bee's hands, let them attack, create shots. Gill. Marrero for three. Pow! Odd. Moses Malone, Cheeks, Antonio. Brea with a gr great drive and an even better flush back up to nine for the Flyers. Gill. Brantley, crossover in traffic, hangs in the air. That's classic to Lil Brant. Good switch off by Gill into Holmes. Might want to double that, and Gill does. They do. Now back out to Bennett for three, and he does it again. Holmes, Gill's going to attack Holmes, and Holmes is up to the challenge. Throws it, and it's a turnover. Shepard's going to accelerate, goes and misses the dunk because he's fouled. Five points so far today. He has two shots here. 71%. It's like he landed yeah. awkwardly to, to jump. Yeah. Holmes now trying to back in Shepard. Help comes fadeaway jumper. It's an air ball, but right into the hands of Santos up it. Brickus driving a kick. Now Marrero catches you three. Pow. Knock Bennett himself. Solid at 82. It's game and miss one, but. Uh, they can shoot fouls. Excuse me, seven for eight. Brantley steps back for three. He has been cold most of the night and remains. And so it's Santos in the open court for the dunk, and that'll put it away, make it a 12-point game with 30. Fierce comeback, which cut it to three, was a bridge too far. And so the Flyers win for the second consecutive year against the Explorers. They remain unblemished in the Atlantic 10 and will go back to Ohio with a 66-54 victory.